of, to the representative of the United States. Thank you, Mr. President. Today we have adopted a UN Security Council resolution enshrining the Joint Comprehensive Plan of Action, JCPOA, agreed to six days ago in Vienna. By now, many are familiar with the basic tenets of the deal, which, if implemented, would cut off all pathways to fizzle material for a nuclear weapon for the Islamic Republic of Iran, while putting in place a rigorous inspection and transparency regime to verify Iran's compliance. This nuclear deal doesn't change our profound concern about human rights violations committed by the Iranian government or about the instability Iran fuels beyond its nuclear program, from its support for terrorist proxies to its repeated threats against Israel to its other destabilizing activities in the region. That is why the United States will continue to invest in the security of our allies in the region and why we will maintain our own sanctions related to Iran's support for terrorism, its ballistic missiles program, and its human rights violations. This deal gives Iran an opportunity to prove to the world that it intends to pursue a nuclear program solely for peaceful purposes. We hope Iran's government will choose that path, not only because it will make the United States, its allies, and the world more secure, though it will, but also because it will more fully empower the Iranian people, whose potential all of us should wish to see unlocked.